Continue on chapter 5, functions and graph. These are the learning outcome for these subtopics. The relationship between graph of f and f inverse. In this lesson, we will find inverse using graphical approach. Notes that the graph of fx and f inverse are symmetric with respect to the line y equal to f. Consider the graph below. fx as a straight line. Let's say fx start at negative a and y intercept is b. Then we have line y equal to x here and f inverse is the reflection of fx at line y equal to x and this is f inverse so fx cross x axis at negative a so f inverse will cross y axis at negative the distance between fx and y equal to x is the same as y equal to x to f inverse and then fx cross y axis at b so f inverse will cross x axis at b so this is the graph of f and f inverse consider the second graph fx f inverse is the reflection of fx at y equal to x so this is y equal to x let's see the graph of fx start at negative a then cross at b f inverse will also cross y axis at negative a and cross x axis at b this is f inverse this is the relationship between f and f inverse example find the inverse of fx equal to square root x plus 1 for x greater or equal to negative 1 and sketch the graph of the function and the inverse to find the inverse function, we'll use the properties f of f inverse equal to x. f is now square root, x is f inverse of x plus 1 equal to x. Simplify f inverse plus 1 equal to x square, so f inverse equal to x square minus 1. Then sketch the graph of the function and the inverse. We have to sketch the graph fx, square root, we need shape, shape is positive square root, positive x, so above and to the right. And second starting point, x plus 1 equal to 0, so x equal negative 1. And constant is 0, so starting point is at negative 1, 0, here, yeah. included. And then sketch graph, negative 1 to infinity. And this graph has y intercept at x equal to 0. For x equal to 0, y equal to square root 0 plus 1. So square root 1. Square root 1 is 1. Label the graph fx. The inverse function is reflection of fx at y equal to x. So y equal to x is here. This is line y equal to x. And then the inverse function is here start at negative 1 so inverse also start at negative 1 and then included inverse also included so this is f inverse of x f and f inverse will cross y equal to x at one point next example for each of the function below finding the inverse function and state the domain and range of f inverse Sketch the graph of f and f inverse on the same axis. So for a, f x equal to negative x squared plus 5 for x greater or equal 0. Find the inverse function using properties f of f inverse equal to x. Negative x is f inverse square plus 5 equal to x. And then f inverse square x minus 5 over negative 1 f inverse equal to 5 minus x square root state domain and range of f inverse so domain and range of f inverse domain of f inverse equal to range of f and range of f inverse equal to domain of f domain of f is x greater than 0 so range of f is also x greater than 0 and then range of f since since fx is quadratic negative x squared plus 5 so range of f is negative infinity up to constant 
5 include cash the graph of f and f inverse on the same axis f is from 0 to infinity and when x equal to 0 y equal to 5 and then fx is negative x squared so 5 included going down label the graph fx cross x exists at square root 5 f inverse is reflection of fx at y equal to x since fx start at 5 so f inverse also start at 5 and then include it and fx start from 5 and going towards negative y so f inverse will start at 5 and going towards negative x this is f inverse cross y exists at square root 5 next example fx equal to square root x minus 2 for x greater or equal to f of f inverse equal to x f is square root x is f inverse minus 2 equal to x so f inverse minus 2 equal to x square and then f inverse equal to x square plus 2 domain of f inverse equal to range of f which is constant for function is 0 so range is start from 0 x positive so infinity and then range of f inverse equal to domain of f x greater or equal to so 2 to infinity sketch graph of f and f inverse f start at 2 and positive value 2 is included so then circle x positive square root positive to the right so this is fx and then f inverse is reflection of fx at y equal to x since fx start at 2 so f inverse also start at 2 included fx going toward positive x so f inverse going towards positive y this is f inverse so f inverse is reflection of fx at y equal to x last example fx equal to 2 plus square root 4 minus x for x less than or equal 4 so f of f inverse equal to x 2 plus square root 4 minus f inverse equal to x square root 4 minus f inverse equal to x minus 2 4 minus f inverse x equal to x minus 2 square and then f inverse equal to to 4 minus x minus 2 square domain of f inverse equal to range of f equal to constant is 2 so range is 2 to infinity and then range of f inverse equal to domain of f x less than or equal 4 so negative infinity to 4 included sketch graph fx is square root function positive square root negative x so above and to the left towards negative x and then starting point 4 minus x equal to 0 so x equal 4 and y equal to 2 4 2 starting point is here and then above and to the right cross y exists at x equal to 0 when x equal to 0 fx equal to 2 plus square root 4 which is 4 label the graph this is fx and then f inverse is reflection of fx at y equal to x so f inverse equal to 2 4 Label the graph f inverse x and the intersection point must be at y equal to x these are your exercises please submit the exercises at the end of lecture